Hey guys, we are back with some more No More Heroes, and uh, I kind of forgot what we were going to do in this episode. But since we just beat Destroy Man, we have a new part-time job, and I will be doing an assassination mission, and my cat is also on the bed with me. She's sniffing my computer because she doesn't know what's going on. A new part-time job is available, and that's, that's pretty much it. So, we're going to head on there just to, you know, get that out of the way. We might explore the town a little more. Probably nothing else really to do, but you know, it doesn't hurt to just look around. So, while I head to this new thing, well, no, okay, I, I had a story I was going to tell, but I, I was I was just going to tell my friend that. So, you know what? You know what? I'm just gonna, I'm just going to tell him. Anyway, I was working today, and today because it's you know President's Weekend or whatever, the kids have off, so working at Friendly's. My, my manager, Phil, just kind of called me in on Sunday. He's like, can, can, can you work tomorrow? I'm like, uh, you know, I, I guess I can. I mean, Mondays are normally the day that I do my homework because that's, like, the only day that I really have off. But, um, holy shit, man. We, we got, like, crazy busy. And it was, holy shit. Right, why are you come here? Sure. Skip through all this. Not necessarily skip, but, you know, he, he says the shame spiel every time. Anyway... Got gas stand. Fill up cars with gas. Oh god. Okay, I don't remember this one at all. Anyway, my manager. He's like, he's not dumb, but he's a little ditzy, and sometimes he's really forgetful. And he also he doesn't he doesn't stand well under pressure. So, oh shit, we got we got like crazy busy today, and like at around one o'clock when. There was a line out the door, and the restaurant was full. He he was just he was just sitting in his office because he was cooking most of the day. And this this lady comes in. She's a pretty cute girl, and uh, she's like, uh, I, I'm supposed to see Phil. I uh, I have my application here. I'm like, uh, he's really busy right now. I'll, I'll I'll give it to him. And so anyway, she leaves, and I take her application and I bring it to the back, like in the office where Phil is, and he's sitting in his chair. He looks just pissed off as fuck, and I give him the application, I'm like, Phil, there's this uh, girl here who wanted me to give you this application, he takes it, he looks at it, and just balls it up and throws it right in the garbage, I'm like, oh my fucking god, you're the coolest manager ever, it was just so funny, though, he, like, he, like, looks at me like, what the fuck are you doing back here, and he just grabs it out of my hand and crumples it, I'm like, oh my god, it was pretty funny, anyway... We have to fill up some cars with gas, and anyone who drives can tell you that gas sucks. Gas stands start. Press the B button to pump gas into the car. Be sure to fill her up just the right amount. Three, how, the how am I two, supposed to tell? One. Oh, I see. What the fuck? Okay, we get lit on fire. That's too much. Is that good? No, that was not. That wasn't good enough. Okay, so we gotta fill, 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 fill. There's one. All right, it's pretty simple. Fill her up. Oh, what the fuck, man? All right, this this job kind of sucks. You get two thousand for every car, which can be really good. And I, we gotta stop. What the hell, man? Jesus, this job sucks. All right, so we gotta fill it again. Are you? kidding me? Like, I'm letting go so early. Okay, little... There we go. Jesus. And we fill it up. No? Okay, thanks, dude. I don't know any gas station that has someone pump your gas for you. I know, I know in, like, one state it's, like, illegal to pump your own gas, I think, and that's just, like, that's just really weird. Like, why? Fucking why? I mean, I guess it does create more jobs, but at the same time, it's like, just fucking why? Alright, so you gotta get, like, above half on the- Oh, I see. Oh my god. That's so simple now! Why didn't I see that before? Maybe because it blends in with the fucking sign in the back. Yes. Like, okay, you see, there's, like, on the bar, there's, like, ooh, cop car. There's, like, th that Luchico sign. It's, like, it almost, like, blends in perfectly with the little dot. It's, like... Why are you doing this to me? Yes. Anyway, this is really simple. I didn't see that. Ooh, more cops. I hate cops. 
Cops ruined my fun. I'm just kidding. They never have before. I got pulled over once, and oh my god, dude, he let me off the warning, and it was just like, oh shit. It was pretty scary, though. Are you fucking cops, dude? I was, I was delivering pizzas at the time, and I was going like, well, apparently I was going 85 on the highway, and I know for a fact I wasn't going 85, because if I was going 85 in my car, my car would fall apart. So anyway, he pulls me over, he's like, so, um, why are you speeding? I'm like, uh, no reason. And, um, anyway, he asked for, like, the license and registration, and I was just like, uh, yeah, I don't, I don't have my license on me, but I know the registration is somewhere in the car, and... He was like, alright, well check the glove box. And I was about to open the glove box, but I remembered. I had some things that in the state of Connecticut are decriminalized in there. And I was like, um, I I know for a fact it's not in the glove box. And he's like, oh, okay, just look around for it. I'm like, holy shit. Because I, I would have been busted and that would have not been cool. Alright, 17. Maybe we might be able to get 18. Probably not. No, fuck. The car's just gone. Anyway, we got a little decent chunk of money. So that's not too bad. Gold? Yeah, we got gold rank. That's good. That's good. Anyway. Let's see what else we're going to do. Or whatever we're going to do. Hey, you third grader. I've got some things for you. Introduction. Might be a little shady. Uh, uh, pardon me. You know what else we got to do? Since we beat Destroy Faggot, we gotta we gotta pump some iron at the gym. Whoa, wait, oh, there's something else that's blinking. Oh, Bishop, help us out, buddy. Travis. We're all friends, but shit like this won't fly. What? Okay, whatever. Anyway, we. I'm going to go to the gym, which is not this way. It's the other. Sorry, cop. Probably filled your gas up for me. And the gym's down that way, so I'm just gonna turn right here. We'll get there soon enough, ladies and gentlemen. My ladies. No ladies are watching my videos. So, oh, you know what else I gotta do? And I will do that in a minute. Thunder Ryu Eldg. Yeah, that. that. So that, right, right. Take off your clothes. Off. I will teach you that technique. Make sure your ass is clean. What the fuck? That. How is that? You like that? What the fuck, man? Training done. This. Yes. Bench press, motherfucker. Okay. I have another story to tell, but that's gonna have to wait. Wait. Is it a, it's not really a story. I can probably tell it now. Um. When I did the little not question and answer, but when I let you guys pick what my next LP is, I kind of forgot that Nintendo Capri Sun, who's pretty much my idol for Let's Playing, I guess you could say, he's going to be doing a Let's Play of Skyward Sword, and I don't really want to be playing through that when he is. I mean... I'm sure it's not that big of a deal, I just, I'd rather prefer, I, I don't like doing the same game that other people are doing currently that I know of, and it would, I don't know, I just, I'd rather wait. I don't know what game I'm gonna be doing, it might not even be a Legend of Zelda game, it might, but strength increased a little bit, so it's good. Got squats to do, but you can only do the dumbbells every other time. Hey guys. So, I'm not entirely sure what my new Let's Play is going to be. I don't think it's going to be a long game. Because I want to do my next Kingdom Hearts game over the summer when I'm not going to have school. And I can pretty much record almost every day that I don't work. Which would be freaking awesome. But, maximum vitality increased a little bit. Alright, so we're done in the gym. But, oh, that leaving already? That, that's it. Come again. Training is not over. Sure thing, dude. So let's play. I'm gonna have to start thinking of some ideas. Some of their ideas. Well, I'm just gonna run around here so I can go to the bar and you know have a drink. Kick back after work. Loretta, what are you doing? 
Sorry, my cat was trying to huh? bring down the curtain. Oh, what do you want? Uh -huh. A ball. I'm gonna turn out to you a technique. Which technique do you want to learn? All right, which one do we want to learn? Displays the pos I don't really want that one. Allows a jumping slash to be performed by shaking the nunchuck. Fuck yes, we'll get this. You ready for this? Let me tickle just a smidge. And Travis gets his ass beat to learn another technique. Learn the technique of love. You got that? Uh, okay. You know. Memory of woman. Let's see. Extends dark side mode. Uh, I'm not, not a huge fan of dark side. Increase the range of your grab. Uh, again, earn bonus. It allows a jumping down attack to be performed by... Okay. We're gonna learn the memory of white. You ready for this? You may tickle just a smidge. Yeah, I found a lot of lava pop balls. Oh, let me tell you. They were everywhere. You learn the technique of crazy awesomeness. It's a nice name. Got that? This technique is yours and yours alone. This ball represents someone's soul. Don't you forget it. You still have balls? You wanna do it again? Alright, what was this one? Displays, uh, Increases the range. Let's fucking get that one, why not? I'm ready for this. A tickle, just a smidge. Now we can grab people farther. We learn the technique of affinity! You got that? Technique is yours, there's a long, but why, man? Yes, you still have balls? Yes, what do we want? Extends dark side mode, displays. Let's get this one. You ready for this? It's a tickle, just a smidge. This is the same thing over and over again, but we're almost done. We just got a couple more things to learn the technique of beauty. So now we got a lot of techniques that we can do. I don't think we have any more lava cop balls, so he sends us away. Oh god, you know what else? You know what's just disgusting beyond all belief? Is that they're making a fucking Fred show. Now, I'm not gonna really bash on the kid because it's just mostly that I'm not a huge fan. But I mean, come on, he's... he... why does... why is he getting a TV show? I don't understand it. Like, in all honesty, I feel like it's gonna last a season, maybe, and then it's just gonna get kicked off the air for another crappy show that they're just gonna force feed to these kids on Nickelodeon. So, guys, I don't really know what else to do right now. Um, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm actually gonna check someone's shop, and the only reason I'm gonna check that, no, not, not be fed. But I'm going to be checking someone else's shop because they have something that I want to see. Alright, anyway, we go in here. There was a lava cop ball around here. I think it was actually next to this truck or somewhere around here or something like that. Anyway, let's go to uh, Naomi. Naomi's lab? I think that's her name. Because, let's face it, Naomi's hot. What? The new model? Dumbass Otaku. What's it look like? Of course it's not done yet. Alright, well. Anyway, I bought all these parts, just to let you guys know. This is only for the Tsubaki, these two. But this one, I think, is for all your Beam Katanas. And it allows you to find treasure, which is, you know, the, the, the whole thing. This music sucks, but at the same time, it's just cool. Anyway, Naomi's hot, and we're not gonna- Oh, yeah, we'll see her again. So! What we're gonna do now is I think we're gonna go... Back! to, oh jeez, the hotel, because, I mean, I don't know, I don't really want to do an assassination mission, they're not really that fun, I mean, they can be kind of cool, but at the same time, I just, I don't know, they're not that great, anyway, we gotta get back to home, holy shit, alright, you know what, that's fine, I'm just gonna leave it there, I don't think anyone will care, uh, so, we come around here, and we go back inside, and I'm going to be saving, and that's about it for this episode of Let's Be Number Heroes. I will see you guys in the next episode, where we will take on the next boss, 
and I actually do not have any idea who it is, so I'm going to actually use the toilet, and I will see you in the next episode, so take huh. care.